Let me pray with you. <clears throat> Father God, I, I want to thank you so much that you love us in such an incredible way. That you desire the best for our lives. And Father, you don't just tell us to do something and then sit back and, and watch us squirm. Lord, you love us and you... You tell us to go in a direction because you want to help us. You want, what's, you want us to have an abundant life. And so you send us in a direction because you know that's what's best for us. And I thank you that you're a God that, that is faithful, that you will be our helper, that we have no reason to be afraid of anything that puts in front of us. Father, I pray that as we're gathered here this weekend, that you would help us to conquer the trickery, the schemes of fear that Satan is using to, uh, to hinder his servants from sharing the good news of Jesus Christ in our world around us. From hindering us from obeying you and doing what you're saying. He's trying to control us. He's trying to keep us boxed up. Lord, let us break out of that box this weekend. Let us break free from our fears. These fears that are binding us, that are holding us down, that, that, are, that have us chained down like slaves. Father, I pray that in the power of your Holy Spirit, you free us from our fears. That this weekend, you've brought us here because this is what you want to do in our hearts. There are people in this room, Lord, that I sense are, uh, there are fears that are controlling them. There are fears that are holding them back. There are fears that are enslaving them. And this weekend, you have them here because you want them to know that you can free them from those fears. You love us. You care for us, and you desire for us to be free from Satan's controls. And one of those being fear. Lord, I, I ask and I pray that your Holy Spirit would move among us. Even as we go off to do the activities for tonight, as we go off and we go to bed and we go to sleep, I pray, Holy Spirit, that you'd be at work in our hearts and our spirits. Help us to be listening to what it is you want uh, to do in our lives. Lord, we want to just lay our lives before you that you might mold and shape us to be who you want us to be. Lord, free us from our fear. Let us be obedient to you. In the name of Jesus we pray. Amen.